Hey guys, welcome at long last to the final mission for Sonic. Obviously, he is involved in the final stage missions, but this is his last actual mission. Hard mode on final rush. Let's go. Let's do this beautiful baby one more time. You gotta love the entrance. Especially this part. Where you're falling down to the first rail and the earth is just below you. I know I keep commenting on how beautiful the earth scenery is. But, I just can't get over it. There's a lot of guys with lasers. We're gonna get these rigs over here, because we don't care about time right now. We can do anything we want. Anything at all. Except for our turn stone and jump the left one. Watch out for that guy. He will wreck you if you do not jump off the rail in time. Because he's kind of, you know, in the way. Get these items down here, just like Baba taught us. Back up over here, and get these special rigs with the spray. 20. If you fill down here to the set of rails below us, that's kind of a shortcut. The thing is, the shortcut takes a long time to actually do. And apparently I'm not going for all those. Oh, you know why I'm not going for those items over there on this run? Because the artificial chaos will wreck you if you try to. You can imagine how that goes when you go for them. I'd go for the artificial chaos first if you do though, because if you just go for the items to start out, you're going to get hit by those guys. No question. Hunting ring mission, the reason I didn't go for those items was because for some reason it takes when I didn't go for those items turned out faster. Obviously watch out for that spike ball. Turned out faster when I didn't go for them. Lost Chow because obviously only time was battery. And time limit because I thought I had less time than I did so I didn't want to waste time slowing down for that. Alright, I'm not going to worry about that guy. He's not that much of a big deal. I'm just going to slide up. That guy's a big deal. He almost hit me. And those bobs almost got launched. If they got launched, I would've been done. Alright, that's the only time you have to jump on that rail, because there's an enemy between you. Alright, I can't use magic- apparently I can't use magic hands when I'm on the floor below him, which is weird, but... Now we got Magnetic Shield. That's what I was thinking about with Shadow and Final Rush, when I thought I was gonna get a shield down there. That's the reason I was confused, and we did that rail perfectly. Uh, I mean, that series of dash pads to the rail. Now let's speed dash up, because there's no dash pad here. Ah, beautiful. Magnetic shield is very helpful right now. And watch out because there's a lot less platforms than they usually are here. And the railings kind of rearranged to make it kind of difficult. Yeah, as you can see, a lot of jumping to different places going on. Because they moved a lot of stuff so that you have to work harder. Oh, the pain, I know. That ring almost got left behind. Eh, it's a, it's something with a... Magnetic shield leaves rings behind. Why can't you just have the rings? Nah, I wouldn't be. It wouldn't have the magnetic field to it if it just went straight to the thing really quickly. It's just a shame when you leave rings behind, man. I'm telling you. I already have magnetic shield. Stupid checkpoint. <laughs> this rail is being obnoxious. Of course it is. I think you kind of have to hit it on the. Lo no, not the lower. Well, yeah, it's better to hit it on the lower portion and to do it, you know. On your second tap of A, you should be really close to the contact point, not far away. Because if you travel a distance before hitting it, after your second tap of A, it kind of decreases your power and you don't slide up all the way. So yeah, hit that stuff hard. And we're sliding down this rail backwards, but Sonic automatically rents himself, so that's cool. Jump over this thing. We are a little over halfway through, I think, or maybe just about halfway through. Trying to remember how it works. And landed awkwardly, so a little bit slow on the update, but we're getting there. We're getting there. Life is still up here, would you know? Yes. That cool thing didn't move away. And the left. Let's go for the left one this time. Yeah, I don't want to do that skipping stuff on the right side where you, you know, go on that rocket thing. I don't feel like doing that. Bye! Let's go this way. We can take our time. Watch out. Although I think it's better to do the other way because you get the life. In fact, this is the shorter way, isn't it? Uh, I need to straighten myself out. I really do. It's, it's Sometimes it's a lot to keep in mind. Alright, this is the way that I missed on the time limit run. It's right there. Boom. Of course, time limit run in hard mode, so I should switch when I took the time to do that and not done it. So, that was just something fun that happened. Those plates missed. And this guy is dead. I thought for sure those things were gonna hit me. 
So what you gotta do is you gotta hit one of these guys. They have the switch to turn that thing off. I'll be right to show you both anyway because I want the points. So the one on the right has the switch to make that trap door not be a jerk. Running away from all this heated metal one more time. I'm just confused about where the heated metal is coming from since at this point in the game, the art cannon isn't hurling towards her. <laughs> nah, some random scrap metal. Bam! And that is the end. I hope you all enjoyed this mission set for the six characters. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Wow, just below 15,000. And next cool. time you will see me finish off all the missions for good with the final stages by missions. Well, four of which we haven't done, one of which we have. Yay, yay, we've cleared all of Solid's missions, got the double emblem. Woohoo, all fun. I will see you all next time. Sayonara.